Hey everyone, Tim of the Knots Network here. We will be introducing a series of our Halloween display. Three different videos about it. Pre-setup, setup, and then Halloween night. So, the first video we got going on right now is the pre-setup. Forgive this shirtlessness, it's been a crazy hot week this week. So, right now I'm going to be making stands that will hold camel netting to hide like certain background, backgrounds and stuff like that. And just to give it kind of a creepier look, I guess. <laughs> they kind of look like the stands that are used at uh, Halloween Horror Nights and just Universal Studios and Hollywood in general. I'll answer the picture right now. So, let's get right to it. them as you saw now I gotta trim them down a little bit to 16 by 16 it's a hot one luckily there's some shade over here all right so I made the base piece boards I got about nine of them but I think I need 12 I have to check my notes but I don't have enough scrap wood this is all from scrap wood so I'll probably have to buy some next now I'm gonna make the poles and then the support pieces for the poles the wood for the supports that hold it on the bottom. base. Now I'm going to drill the poles to the base in the center and then attach these for extra support. Bye. 
the finished product. They don't have to be perfect. I am gonna put weights on the bottom of them. They're mainly to hold camo netting. I still have a few more to make, but that's all you're gonna see at this segment. Next will be painting, and there's a few other little things to do that you'll see along the video. Until then, This is like some Florida status here. Feels good though. I was boiling up earlier. All the days, all the days it had to rain. All the days, all the days. <laughs> Several days later. Alrighty. In this section of the video for our prepping the chop time, we have our carvable pumpkins that we buy every year. We kind of stopped on the um, real ones. We bought some last year, but we didn't have time to um, carve them. But these ones, at least when you carve these, they last forever. Well, at least 10 plus years, right? So, this one's Mary's. And this one's mine. So, I'm going to cut them. the finished results haven't painted them yet Mary will do that another night another segment of the video here's how they look this one's Mary's right here and then this one is mine cool yeah several days later so 
tonight we are working on spookifying the pumpkins. Mary's already got a few done as you can see. This is a big one right here. There's those ones we carved the other night. And yeah, there's uh, three more she's got to do. And we might do some tombstones too. We'll see. Yeah. See how I know it's a full moon right now? I hear men ra yelling random in the pitch black darkness. Yes, they're howling. They're howling. Yeah, the at moon's full. See? It's a full moon tonight. Ooh. It's the hunter's moon! several days later. All right, we are on night two. Mary is painting stands that are basically gonna hold camera netting to hide certain things in the background of our display. 